Now finally, the Dead Sea Scrolls have been fascinating archaeologists and history buffs since the 1940s, and a big part of this fascination is just how they were so well preserved. Well, a new study released by researchers of the Journal of Science Advances now gives us an answer. And here with the story is ILTV's Nittany Manson. Hi, Aaron. Yeah, that's right. So taking a tiny step back, just mm -hmm. for those of our viewers who maybe don't know about the Dead Sea Scrolls, um, since 1947, there have been thousands of pieces of parchment found in the Dead Sea region, uh, and they've all been classified as the Dead Sea Scrolls. Well, the first of these was actually first found when a Bedouin shepherd had a runaway sheep who ended up in a cave, <laughs> and when he went looking for the sheep, he actually came across these huge clay jars filled with scrolls. Wow. Um, and over the years, archaeologists have found 900 manuscripts and upwards of 50,000 scroll fragments. And the Israel Museum actually even boasts a collection of over 1,000 scrolls. That's amazing. All right, well, you know, that's, that's what's so exciting about these scrolls is that they are the oldest documented Hebrew writing to ever have been found, correct? Yeah, uh, and some were even written partially in Aramaic. Uh, Aaron, we're talking about scrolls that were written around 2,000 years ago, so sure. it's a big deal. Okay, so let's get back to this new study then. Mm -hmm. You know, like what exactly uh, does it tell us about the scrolls? Well, this study was done on one particular scroll, the Temple Scroll, mm -hmm. which stands out because it has a different coloring to it and it's actually in amazing shape. All right, so they were looking into, into why that is, like why it's in such good shape? Exactly, um, and they found that it was actually prepared in a different way than the other scrolls. They were all written on animal hide, which was cleaned, thinned, and dried before writing on it, but they found that this one had an extra layer of inorganic material that finished off the process after the writing was done. All right, and what does that really mean? Like, what are, <laughs> what are the researchers taking from this find? Well, basically, it suggests that the scroll was not written in the Dead Sea area. Uh, mm. The minerals that were found in the extra layer um, are similar to ones used by the Babylonians and the Greeks. And these minerals aren't even found in the Dead Sea region. So they're pretty much saying that the scroll was probably written somewhere else and brought over. Wow, and this opens up probably a whole new line of questions then. Yeah, I mean, where was it written? Who right. brought it over? Why? A, a lot of questions come sure. up here. All right, well, you know, if there are any updates, I trust that you will be right back with us uh, in the studio. Nittany, thank you so much. Of course, my pleasure.